Even if mosquitoes and raindrops are somewhere the same size, a single raindrop can have a mass that is up to 50 times the mass of a mosquito and falling with a speed of around 10 meters per second. But how are then mosquitoes able to fly by rain without getting hurt or wet? When a raindrop falls, it pushes some air in front of itself in form of a tiny pressure wave. When the drop gets close to the mosquito, there's a high probability that the pressure wave will push the mosquito by side because of its small mass. But what happens when the mosquito gets hit directly? There are two scenarios. The first is that the mosquito gets hit in the legs or wings. And the second is that it comes to a direct collision between the drop and the body of the mosquito. Based on a recent study, when the drop hits the mosquito's wings or legs, the mosquito simply rotates around the drop and quickly regains normal flight. This happens because its body is designed to refuse water and can get wet. When it comes to a direct collision, which is not probable, the mosquito gets hit hard and drops in altitude, but it takes just a friction of the full momentum. This happens because the mass of the mosquito is too small to slow down the drop significantly, so the resulting force on the mosquito is small. By such a collision, mosquito simply goes with the drop and use their wings and long legs as miniature sails to lift themselves of the falling drop before they crash into the ground, which means they are in most danger when they fly near the ground. So mosquitoes are able to fly by rain because of their small mass, water refusing body and the air pressure wave in front of the drop. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video and don't forget to subscribe for more content on this channel. Have a nice day and bye.